Looking to the left and turning to the right. Hey there, church family. Thanks for tuning in. I just want to talk about faith. I want to talk about the kind of faith that really changes and moves mountains. For many of us, we know what a quiet faith is. It's a, it's a quiet trust. It's a, it's, a, it's a faith that we know, that we know, that we know. We know that God is always for us. We know that God is always healing us. We know that God's word is true. But a quiet faith isn't always the strategy to deploy. Sometimes the strategy for faith is a bold and audacious faith. It's an outspoken faith. It's an expressive faith. It's an expression where we put into place and we put into action what is required to see things take place. Friends, a quiet faith is that knowing that our personal salvation is absolutely sure when we confess Jesus Christ as our Lord and our Saviour. But friends, a bold faith is what the Bible describe, describes as uh, without action, faith is dead. Without movement, our faith is dead. And you see, friends, as we press in to a new season of taking ground, a new season of, uh, <clears throat> of God advancing us forward as a church, my encouragement to you is this. Have a bold faith. Have a faith that moves mountains because what you are doing is taking action and applying what you believe God to be. Father God is a jealous God. He is a jealous God that longs for us to step into a boldness, a fresh boldness of where he longs to see breakthrough continuously in and through your life and throughout the whole earth. Friends, we have uh, a new wall at church and it's called the in 2019, I am believing God for wall. That wall behind me is for you to write up, to write on the wall what you are believing God for. And be prepared that as you believe, when somebody believes, they step into that moment of bold faith. Faith that is loud. Faith that is lived. <clears throat> And most of all, faith that is applied. So I ask you in it and implore you, there's such an urgency in my spirit right now that we would step into that new area of faith as a church. Step into it, run into it, worship hard, pray hard and live boldly. God bless you. Bye for now.